All right, what's going on, guys? I am bringing you a 75 to 0 team deathmatch gameplay on slums. This is actually in the arms race playlist as well. And also, just a little clarification, I guess. It is not a 75 0 by a single player, it is 75 to 0 as a team. As in, you know, they didn't manage to get one kill on us during this whole gameplay, and that was pretty cool. Also, this is recorded from, not from my point of view, I was in this gameplay. Yeah, I, I think I go 12 and 0. But um, this is recorded from Potential's point of view because he did the best. And also, if you guys saw from that scoreboard in the beginning, um, we had all just recently reset. So he's the only one that had B-set on and stuff. And uh, he's the only one that had like the class set up that you know, enabled him to move around and rush and stuff. So that's why I'm doing it from his point of view because we all kind of just sat back, let him get that V-set, and then we kind of pushed up to get the kills. So that's pretty much that. Um, if you guys could leave a like right on this video, that would be much appreciated. Try to hit 500. I think it's pretty cool. I definitely don't think you guys have seen something like this before. Um, I did upload one during Black Ops 1. Oh, I got it on Black Ops 1. It was during the life cycle of Modern Warfare 3. And that video has like over 100,000 views. I don't know why. Um, you know, it's just one of those videos I guess people really enjoyed. Thought it was a cool concept. So I thought, you know, we, we pretty much have been trying to do this for a long time in Black Ops 2. And uh, the problem with TDM, as you guys already know, is it's, it's pretty hard to get a V set actually. You gotta get 10 kills. And uh, 12 without hardline, so it's actually really annoying to try to get a VSAT. And then especially trying to get a VSAT without anyone on your team dying before that is even harder. So uh, with this new edition of Arms Race, it made this challenge like a little bit easier. It was It's still hard to do. I definitely, if you guys want to try it out, I definitely encourage you to go out, get like five of your friends and uh, try to get this 75-0 shutout. It's actually kind of hard. Everyone has to be a good player. You can't play with any, you know, bad people. Or else it's just not going to work. And, um, you know, also, we didn't have our classes. Like, none of us had flak jacket. So, that, that made it kind of, like, risky. That's why we all didn't want to push out like crazy. Um, until, you know, we had UAVs and VSATs up and whatnot. And, um, you know, that just it made it a little bit more challenging. But, you know, we got it done. I think we also had, like, a 75 and 1. Had a 75 and 2. Pretty much a bunch of fails. And uh, it probably took over, like, 100 games to get this one gameplay. So, um, it, it wasn't the easiest thing to do, but uh, I don't think we would have gotten it without Arms Race. Arms Race definitely made it a lot easier, and uh, I don't know, pretty cool. I like Arms Race a lot. If you guys haven't been playing it, I definitely recommend to play it. Um, it's pretty fun. The main thing about TDM was that it's just so hard to get streaks, but now with Arms Race, it's actually fairly easy to get your streaks, so uh, it makes it a lot more enjoyable. A lot less campy as well, I feel. I don't know. That's just my personal opinion, but yeah. That's pretty much it, man. 75-0, shutout, slums, TDM. This is, I think it's like the first one, I don't know. But, uh, not really gonna put that in title or anything, I don't really care. But yeah, that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching, guys. Leave a like rating if you enjoyed. Let's try to hit 500. And, uh, yeah. Thanks for watching. Have a good day. Peace out. Operation complete. Nice job, grunts.